Well, hello everyone, and welcome to Diamond Paintings with me, your host Mike, Magnificent Independence Kite Elite. Yes, we're back live, and it's great to be back live. We've had a long hiatus, and uh, <laughs> we are back. So, um, yeah, um, the stream could face a couple of technical issues because I'm a little bit rusty. I've not done this for a while. Um, so, yeah, we're just... Um, you know, go with flow, and if there's, if you can't hear me, then just let me know. Um, we're going to be doing roughly about an hour today, so yeah, we'll be doing an hour or so. Now, where's the button I need? So this is where we left off, so you guys probably haven't even seen up to here. Now, originally, we was going to be doing it, delaying it, till we got up to, where was it, somewhere here, and then I was going to, like, delay it a bit, um but unfortunately that went out the window we had a few technical issues which prevented whip four going up late and then whip fives got stuck behind it so hello we have a comment can you hear the pigeon he's going anyway um uh, hi how are you can you hear me tester okay is everything good on the sound um if, if you can let me know um, I'm good, pretty good, yeah, and uh, yeah, so it was delayed, so I've actually done all of up to about here, so we're going to be hopefully working on this patch, so uh, let's get down to, let me switch that thing and jig over, because uh, I can pull it on the, can hear you nice and loud, lovely, so there's no squeaky or echoey or anything like that, wow, look at that, done it first time, eh, um, fantastic, right, I need a cover minder, so we're going to pinch Liz Harrison's, I've done a tester here, because she puts hers on the clamp, on the tripod, and what I've done is, <laughs> what I've done, what I've done is actually put the magnet up here, so you see I can go like that, and it clips on. So, yeah, we won't be losing that again. Right, so let's get the uh, the magnet, because uh, we need to put that under there. We'll put Liz Harrison's... Um, hello, it's uh, walking away from us. <laughs> we'll put Liz Harrison's cover mind up like so, and we'll get started. Now, yesterday, it was so funny, because I was... I was like, I've left that bit because I can't find the three and I can't find the C. And oh my God, getting ready for the live today, I have only gone and found. They were kitted up the whole time. So how that's happened, I don't know. But uh, what are you up to, Tessa? Anything lovely there? How's it all going? So what we'll do is we'll focus on a bit of patchiness for the minute. Um, we'll get some lovely waxy woo and um, just get that all waxed up. So, yeah, I've done it for six o'clock. So, because um, I know like a lot of my American viewers like to watch live, but I don't know what time it would be in America at the moment. So, hopefully, that works for you. Um, so, yeah. Right. So, what have we done today? Well, <laughs> I've just had a Big Mac. I've just been doing it. What's that say? Oh, it's good to be back live, isn't it? I'm just doing some diamond painting on my red horse barn. You've been working on that for ages, Tessa. Um, so that's good to know. So you're probably watching me on the TV then, not through the phone. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's, you know, it just feels really weird coming back to lives because I took a break. Because I was finding that I was going over the hour a lot. So I was using like the majority of my stream hour up. So I was like, do you know what? I'm just going to like take a break and then come back to it and just hope that we stick to it. Um, so, yeah, this isn't going to make a lot of sense because you're going to see this bit before you see that bit. But it is what it is. It's We had a major technical problem with WIT4, which required a lot of edits and a lot of cuts. So it took forever. But yes, as I was saying, I've just had a ginormous meal because <laughs> I eat twice as much. You know, I'm a big lad. So I got a Big Mac, you know, a meal. And then I got a, what was it, a cheeseburger. And then, wait for it, I got a big, um, a bacon and cheeseburger. And then I got chicken McNuggets. I'm so naughty. I was like proper hungry. When you've been working all day, it's, it's you know, the energy needs it. So, 
Yeah. Um, and to my amazement, they had no McFlurries. It's almost like the McFlurry machine was broke. I couldn't believe it. So I got lumped up with an apple pie. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I've just finished that. Um, literally had half an hour to eat the damn thing. And, yeah, I'm rushing into this now. So feel free to ask me any questions. We do. We will be showing an exclusive as well. So I'm going to be showing an exclusive. Um, so, yeah. But what's everyone been up to? Um, I'm getting, um, I won't be able to use Alexa because we, I've, uh, had an upgrade to my internet thing and I'm getting used to these machines called an Eero. Um, these are like booster things to make the signal a bit better. So, um, that's plugged in at the moment because I feel like we might need that booster just in case it plays up, um, and starts buffering. So, yeah, getting used to them. Um, but apparently they can actually be used on their own without the router. So I don't know how that works. But, yeah, um, it's like a Wi-Fi box in your room. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. I decided not to go to the range today. I was I was um, at the range last Thursday evening. And uh, I've decided to leave it this week um, because I wanted to go live. So... We'll do that instead. And then we have exciting news because if I just go down and swap that banner, let me go right the way down here. And we have exclusive news. The lovely Liz Harrison is sending me another gift bag. So isn't that good? I've got a lovely um, painting from her. Um, I technically know what it is because when I was watching, I'm not going to give too much away. But when I was watching one of her videos, something in there really grabbed my attention. And I was like, I jokingly said on the comments, can I have that? And she's only gone and sent me it free of charge. Like, I couldn't believe that. So she knows I love this thing. So that was ever so sweet of her to do that. <coughs> Apologies there. But we have a comment. And I'll get to that. I think, yeah, we've got some three tacks behind here. So let me just move that down. And um, I've had this horrible headache all day. It just will not budge. Um, so I don't know. I've checked the medication. I've had so I don't know what's causing it. Hello, we have a comment. La, la, la. Um, and obviously, we've also got new. Um, you're doing it again, Steve. No, Michael. Michael is banned. <laughs> Hello, Steve. How are you doing? I just knew he would do that. He's got this thing about calling me Michael to wind me up. <laughs> but, yeah, how are you, Steve? How's it going? I still haven't found that photo of you at um, uh, Gerwich Castle. So, yeah, I don't know where that is. But, yeah, oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? It's all patched up. Lovely. Fantastic. So, I did start this line. Um when was it last night so we'll start working on this line now but yes um what was we talking about i can't remember now oh yes the range so i left the range but i'll tell you something yeah you're gonna love i'll tell you something you are so you know i'm not gonna give too much away but you're the next range unboxing i think you'll be pleased with this one steve so yeah um yeah, it's uh, a proper good one. And the funny thing is, is that he left a comment and he said, get this one or that one. And I, one of them is correct in what he said. And I was like, no way. How could he have got that on, you know, so quick and so spot on? So I think you're going to like what I've got um, in the next range. I think next week is a Timu. And then we'll be going back to the range, my new favourite shop. I'm slightly edging away from, uh, you know, um, Timo. I should be getting another Titanic, but it's it's just taking forever. So, hello. We have another one. Evening, Mike. Thank you very much, Steve. That's very kind of you to call me that. Um, Michael just makes me sound old. That is my legal name, by the way, but... I just don't like being called it because it just drags. It just sounds like a very old man's name. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, should I show you an exclusive or what to do? 
I don't know if I should. Let's get some funnel work done first. And then I may, because you know what live shows mean? That means exclusive time. So, yeah. Did you know, Steve, Fan Home may be bringing out the, um, what's it called? The Marvel Museum Collection. I'm pretty damn sure it's that. Because there was teasing about group, but I, but seeing all like the shields on there, mm, I think it's the Marvel Museum one, you know. And have you heard the latest? They've scrapped the Ecto One. What's going on with that? They've actually like decided not to make it anymore. So I don't know what's going on there. There's a lot of big changes happening. But yeah, couldn't believe that. I mean, that's only just come out and then they've relaunched the Enterprise again. So they keep relaunching the same thing. <laughs> So, yeah, I'm eagerly awaiting for, um, actually, I'll keep that a surprise. Yeah. So, what's if you, oh, sorry, what's that say? Um, I have a tiny Wi-Fi box in my room like yours does the same. Well, I don't technically need this because I'm on, like, the fastest package, but they sent me that it comes in with, like, the package thing. So this is called an Eero. Now, these are the machines that are operated by Amazon. So, yeah, I don't really need it, but it's just in case, like, it starts to buffer. I plug it in just in case, just to stretch the signal a bit. Um, yeah, so Epic, uh, what was that? Ecto-1 was an Epic build. It certainly is. It's just, if you've ever seen, J um, oh, what's his name? Oh, God. Adam Savage unboxing. If you've seen that, good God, it is brilliant. It's a beast. The size of that box. Because he got shipped the whole thing, didn't he? So, yeah, lovely chap, um, Adam Savage, because he showed us all the, the unboxing for it. But, yeah, it's a whopper. <laughs> but, yeah... So what's everyone doing? I'm diamond painting. Tessa's diamond painting. I don't know what Steve's doing. Probably watching me with a lovely whiskey, hopefully. Um, yeah, okay. So we need a seven. So we do Lemon Goodman there. Seven! <laughs> I do love that judge. He's the only judge in Strictly that goes, like, he'll, he'll drag it. He won't say seven, he'll drag it, but he uh, unfortunately passed away. What am I doing here? I can't find my sevens. I've lost it. Lost it, lost it, no. All right, I'm going to have to go through all of this. There it is. Lovely. So what's the time? How long have we been going for? 13 minutes. Let's get to halfway, and then I'm going to show you... Um, an exclusive so then we need f which is that one so yeah and then we need c which is this one over here and um, what's that save mythbusters uh it was a good show ah okay i'll have to watch that let me drop that down so i don't know if i've got a notepad in here oh, bugger um let's get this piece of paper down here yeah. So what's that called, Miff? Do you like my new? Look, I have to get this. Look at this. My new, brand new flamingo pen. There's the first exclusive. But what's that called, Mythbusters? Mythbusters. I might not want to know about that. Maybe YouTube. So I put that on Mythbusters. Um, it's probably on YouTube to do. So I'll sort that out later. But yes, I had to get this. Absolutely gorgeous. I do think if you're writing with a pen, it's got to have a, a perfect pen. Now, technically, I could mod that. I could cut that off and put one of these up it. So <laughs> one of these, um, you know, these contraption things and mod that into a perfectly good pen. So, um, yes, I had to have that. I fell in love with flamingos ever since watching Linda Carter on uh, EastEnders because she has that. You know, that back wall, don't she? Full of EastEnders, um, flamingos there. But Chelmsford has recently turned very famous because I've just found out there's a restaurant called Queenie's. 
and a lot of the EastEnders cars visit there. So uh, I'm not far from Chelmsford. So apparently Jacqueline Joss has been down there. So that's quite interesting. Right. What's happened here? What's that number four? That is this one over here. So this very horrible diarrhea looking colour here. Um, <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, it's good to be back live. I have missed it. But you need a break in a while. Uh, what is that one? Is that five? Then we've got H. There's so much swapping and changing here. Um, right, now what have I done with that? J. Hmm. Well, I did have it. So where's it gone? How bizarre. Okay, that's interesting. Jay's vanished. A bit like Vanish Oxy Actor, really, but... <laughs> oh, no. It's gone. I could have sworn I kitted that. Oh, yes, there it is. Look, it's hunting behind Miss winning Sips Cup. <laughs> uh, Jay is... I think you'll find that is. Yeah, that's the one. Lovely. Thank you very much. So, tell you what, the, the weather's been quite hot lately. It's um, quite hot, yeah. And then we want one. So, Justin Nikolai, how do you, what do you think of the uh, picture so far? Looking good, isn't it? We want seven. Where's my seven gone? This painting requires a hell of a lot of concentration. Because there's so much colour swapping. But yes. All right, seven again. And it's oh, good God! It's getting busy. It's getting busy. <laughs> One and then J. Now, there's um, another thing I've got to do. Oh, what have we got there? It says, uh, I hate confetti. I love the colour blocking more. I don't mind confetti, but if it's like this area where it's like every other jewel is a different colour, it does sort of like get a bit on your nerves sort of thing. A bit like Joe Pasquale with I've got a song that will get on your nerves. Uh, <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's I much prefer colour block because remember over here we've done a hell of a lot of blue. So I don't mind it, but yeah, that's what's putting me off of the, I really want to get that one you've got the, you know, that film up and it's got the balloons tied to the house. I would love to do that, but seeing all them colour changes, mm, no, I can't do it. I, I don't think I'd manage that. It would take me a long time to do it, I think, but I'd love to do that. Lady, um, I'm working on a, um, and it said I'm working on a tramp. <laughs> um, I'm working on a painting of Lady and the Tramp by um, Tiger Lily Bex because she sent me it as a gift. So, yeah, I've been working on that. I'll show you an exclusive in a minute. Um, where's my tear over here? So, yeah. But, yeah, I'm the same as you. I, I much prefer rounds and I much prefer colour block, I think. Sorry about the flatulence there. It, you know, I'm in voluntary movement and all that. So uh, you got to let rip when you got to let rip. <laughs> I had a comment like that. <laughs> I had a comment like that once and I let rip because obviously it's an involuntary movement. And someone said that is so disgusting. And I'm like, well, you can't exactly control it, can you? So like whatever you know but yeah i found that quite awfully funny um but yeah i definitely i'd say i've got probably about nine projects on the go at the moment so yeah uh johnny five i'd love to do a johnny five painting and i'd love to do a johnny five part work that would just be amazing they've got to do it i mean they bring out the terminator 
The Terminator. Killer Terminator. I've actually got the Terminator, just bear with me. Are you ready? It's the Terminator. Yay! This is one of my oldest builds, and I love it. Oh, blimey. It's all falling a bit here. So sorry about that. Um, my tripod scared. Where? Oh, no. Oh, dear. Just bear with me. We've got a campage problem. I've just knocked the camp flying. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear me right yeah so that's one of my oldest builds which i very much dearly love but unfortunately as time has gone on i've uh i can't complete it because i've only got stuck with the head um the other bits are in the, the thing jig in the box but that build's long and gone so i can't get the parts for it unfortunately but you know we will figure out a way of getting the parts um, so yeah, always hold on, you never know, someone might, out there might have the parts and we'll uh, whack them on vintage and I can buy them, <laughs> I would actually do that, you know, just whack them on vintage and then let me know and I'll pay up, get it all paid up, but yeah, so lots of exciting things are happening soon on the channel, we're doing night streams, which is going to be quite cool, 12 at night till 6 in the morning, Cannot wait for that, but it has to be on the weekend because obviously I work through the week, so it has to be on the weekend. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to do that. The plan is to get and you know fall from start to finish of the painting. That would just be amazing. Right, Q. There we go. Oh dear me, we've got so much colour changing here, Tessa. Do you fancy coming man, Tessa? You can do the confetti if you like. There's so much colour change. <laughs> it does drive you insane. Um, K's over here, I think. It's this lovely blue. Yeah, there it is. This gorgeous turquoise. It's a lovely one, that. Okay. Now it's back to how do you do your confetti tester? Do you like stack all the trays up like this and keep doing what I do with the swapping and changing? How do you do yours? Let's change that banner that's been on there a while. We've got a brand new channel here, ASMR with Mike. Yes, we do ASMR. Um so yeah, it's uh something I've always wanted to do. So yeah. Okay, so F. I wonder if Lynn's is up because it was so funny. So I was watching a video and then I watched the comments and I was going through all the comments, approving them and because all comments that come to me go to help for review just to restrict spam and stuff. And she says something along the lines of something to do with issue. I think it was whip three of Titanic. Apparently I said a, uh, Something along the lines of a buster box or something. Do me a favour, Tessery, um, Tess if you don't mind. Can you go to Whip 3, bring up Linda's comment, and tell me what she said. It's something like Buster Pop or Bucky Pop, something like that. And I was like, what the hell? So I'm going to have to go back over that video and find out what she's referring to, because I don't know what that means. So I'm, apparently I said something about a bucko pop or something. <laughs> And I was like, oh, man, I don't know what the hell I was talking about then. Right. So now we've got three again. This is how many colours I'm dealing with right now. It is just, like, swamped. <laughs> so, hello. Sorry, we've got a comment there. How can I help? Uh, let me get to a lovely... Did you know these are called winning sips so the idea is you buy it from mcdonald's yeah and it's called winning sips so you peel off this sticker and you're supposed to like win a prize and stuff but let's get on to um the comment there and it says uh thanks to do if i had confetti yeah and we've got i keep my diamonds up then i just look for the number on the painting 
Right, okay. Um, yeah. Okay, yeah. Sorry, I was going to have a bit of that Coca-Cola, weren't I? Oh, Jesus. I bloody drank it all. It's a good job that I have this. I always have refreshments on standby, so I've got this lovely watermelon drink. You would not believe, I couldn't believe it. So I went, in, I went into the one shop, um, and this is what's really good about it. Look at this, absolutely bargain. Um, ooh. Okay, I don't know what that means, but yeah. Let me just go on. I'm trying to, just trying to find the one shop. Um, sorry, not, <laughs> not the one shop. It's called One Stop, sorry. Bloody one shop. <laughs> but if you go on to the one stop, they've got this fantastic deal. Look at this. Two for £3.50, Coca-Cola litre variants. And you get two different drinks. Three fifty. that's a bargain. Like, I can't believe that. Absolute bargain. So, yeah. Um, ah, right, you've sent it, just sent it through the message of the comment. What line is that? Is that line one or five? Line one, two, three, or five? One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Just let me know what line, because, uh, I have multiple lines for different things, so. <laughs> That's the trouble when you have, like, various different YouTube accounts, because you've got to have a definite separate line for each thing so yeah um but yeah i couldn't believe that 350 for that considering like they're probably like two pound each i thought that was a fantastic deal so i got the watermelon one and i did get a lemon one but um i've not tried that yet so let's have a look so it's line one okay that's fine let me get up and it says so linda's comment was something to do with so a bunker pops <laughs> so this is what i don't understand what that means so linda put on whip three titanic she put wasn't me that had bunker pops or whatever you called them so i don't know what i said in that video so if anyone thinks they know the answer do let linda know but i'm gonna have to watch that video back because i don't know what a bunko pop is i did mention the word funko pop f-u-n-k-o so it could have been that, which you're referring to. A Funko Pop is like a little, it's like a little toy thing um, with a wobbly head. <laughs> well, some some do and some don't, but yeah, yeah, I think that's what you're referring to, Funko Pop, because I mentioned a comment saying to do with the Funko Pop with an ET T-shirt. So the chances are that's what you're referring to. So I hope that clarifies that for you. But I'm sure you had a Funko Pop. Someone who diamond paints has one. And I can't remember who it was. Thanks for that, Tess. I appreciate that. Because obviously I, I can't do everything myself. Because uh, I'm trying to whip and read comments. And did you know we're bringing back the show of me and Tessa doing diamond painting with the Dalmatian as well. Can't wait for that. We've not worked on it for so long. We just like busy and if i'm busy then something comes up then she's busy and it's just been havoc trying to book it in so we've just sort of like had a big break from it but we're going to be bringing it back bunko pop it yeah it was funny when you left that because i was like what the hell <laughs> but yes yeah, Right, so then we need... Where's the F gone? I've lost it. Need that one, yep. Yeah. Hello. Hello from the outside. Anyway, um, I think it is the one for the diamond painting one. Uh, can you rejog my memory? What do you mean by that? I think it is the one for diamond painting one. Oh, you mean the line one? Yes, line one is diamond painting. Line two is personal. Line three is crafts line four is models so and then line five is um asmr so yeah so we've done that one let's have yeah let's have that one when i have this one is it so yeah we'll have that one so yeah but i do
All right, that's that. And just to clarify, I have stopped Messenger, but I do still keep some people on there because obviously I'm a co-host for them or they're a co-host for me. So obviously we do need to um, keep some people on there. Um, so, yeah, I just want to clarify that, that I don't do Messenger anymore. I had to stop it because I had so many messages coming in and I, can't, I just can't. I, it's very hard managing five lines and five email accounts as well. So something had to give. So, yeah, so you can still contact me in that via email or, you know, pop it in the comment. But what I'm trying to do as well is put it, keep it all in one place. It's very hard to comment here, then refer back to that if you're trying to reply to something on here. So, yeah. But, yes, yeah, thank you very much, Tessa. How is Sammy? Love you. He's such a sweet dog because he's... Uh, He's got some um, epilepsy, so he's uh, he used to have like constant fits, and now the medication that he's on is uh, all fixed. Hope that's okay to discuss that, Tess. Obviously, I, it's not my place to say, but um, I know you'll be okay with that. So I don't know why I'm asking, really. <laughs> I've seen some lovely paintings in the works, and I want to get them because they're calling my name but i'm nearly finished on the ones from the range there's not really any that are grabbing my attention really where's that come from then we've got two oranges here what's that from that must be from here i can't have messy drills or you know ones oh do you know what it was so funny so i put on my community tab i've took it down now because i need i'd like to keep things on the community tab for like 24 hours and then remove it just to keep it tidy and i generally use my fridge as a storage shelf it makes a perfect shelf and i didn't realize there was drills on it and went to open the door and all oh, the bloody drills fell in this inside of the door and i thought you know what this is not worth my time in you know just like separating all these i've done that before on various paintings and it took four hours never again so i thought you know what can't be losses i literally paid a pound on this thing so it was just easier to like rebuy it just a pound down the drain but weigh up the balance you know if it's going to take forever to like go right this one goes here that one goes there i can't be dealing with that no scoop it up trash it get more <laughs> so yes sorry we've got a comment there let me just get one more let's get one of them in there i'm going to have a bit of my i've got this lovely drink look at this this is absolutely lovely if you've you know you've never tried this you should so get this this is called the Fanta. There was a blue one ages ago, and they, they wouldn't give you the name of it. You sort of had to guess it. But this, you've got to try this. Look at this. Fanta watermelon. It's Well, actually, it's, um, yeah, watermelon. I got confused then because there's another one that's called Fanta Twist. So, but yeah, absolutely gorgeous, that. Right, let's get to um, a comment there. And it says, this is fine. Yes, see, I knew it would be. Uh, that is fine, Sammy Good. I always say at the start of my videos, what's that? Um, oh, what, the epilepsy thing? Yeah, because uh, it's, um, it's good to show awareness of the, <coughs> of the epilepsy and things. So I think one of the dogs, I used to sponsor Dogs Trust many years ago. And um, one of the dogs that they had had epilepsy, and he was a lovely dog, Jack Russell, called Sam, funny enough. And he always used to wear, like, this handkerchief around his neck. And he sadly passed away from that. So, yeah. I don't know where that D is. I had that D, but I can't remember where I've put it. That's fine. We'll patch it up next time. No problem, eh? So just so you know, you will see, when you see this tomorrow, what's tomorrow, Friday, yeah. So you're going to see somewhere up here, probably, because there was delays with, oh man, it was taking forever. So 
I'm going to put an additional show in on Saturday just to um, compensate for the missed video. Um, so, yeah. Oh, uh, where's minute nine? Move on. Um, now what do I need? Five. So, Linda, is this wet in your appetite to, uh, you know, buy it? <laughs> oh, okay. I've just realised we forgot to do the exclusive. I'm so sorry about this. Uh, I've just gone over. We've gone five minutes over. So where's my cup gone? Let me have a drink, and then I'm going to show you an exclusive because we've done a you know a bit of patching up. Oh, that's gorgeous. It's really fruity and yeah, love it. Um, yeah, okay, so we've had that. Good. Let's change that banner because we've had that banner going for a minute. So remind you, uh, um, <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Um, so as you know, we like my live shows, I like to show an exclusive, and this is one I don't like showing ones that I've you know, ones that I'm working on without going for the unboxing first, but I have to show you this. This is one I got last Thursday evening, and look at this. It's one that I was really debating about because it's not really the sort of thing I'd go for. As you know, I love doing animal paintings, but I've been working on this. Look at that. So, okay. Uh, <laughs> this is the unicorn with the lady, and I've just been working on uh, round about probably this line here. So I've just done like a separation line there. But the colours in this is absolutely gorgeous. Let's get it on the other camera. It might come up better. But yeah, let's... Um, this is one that I've been working on the last couple of days. And it's absolutely gorgeous. The colours in it are phenomenal. Not too dark, not too light, just right. But it's like the grey-blue colours. I've never worked on them colours before. And what is nice is that the unicorn is just going to the centre of this. Um, Diamond by Nat, uh, she recommended that I swapped it for ABs, but I just remembered that that's in reference to another painting, so ignore that. She was talking about swapping the ABs for that moon one that I showed you. And then down here, you got like the black and blue hair, and it so reminds me of Medusa. And then, um, yeah, you've got this lovely green line, which I've, I've never used that drill before, but it's getting there. So, um, yeah. Had to show you that, guys. So the next show, let's put that thingamajig up. So the next live show will be, because I've got a busy week next week, so I can't do it next week. But next week, it's going to be, um, sorry, on the 26th, it'll be Friday, and I may show another exclusive. But yeah, so what do you think of that? Let us know in the comments. If you want to get it, it's currently, I think it was 2 dollars in the range. So yeah, it's uh, quite a nice one, that. And it's, it's nice to do a figure because I don't think I've done that many. I don't think I've ever done like a woman figure, have I? I've done various like um, buildings, but not really. If I have done a women figure, then do let me know. But I do so many. I, uh, I can't remember. <laughs> so, yeah, when you see the unboxing... You've seen it already, so you don't have to worry about watching the unboxing. Or you can. There's other ones in there. So, yeah. Right. So, let's get the seed on. Do you know what, Tess? I've had this headache all day, and it just will not budge. It's one of them annoying ones that just stay at the back of your head and just won't budge away. So... Very, very frustrating. I've got an ice pack that I might use. And they used to buy these, like, cooler strip things that you put on your head that is supposed to, like, take it away. But I have to go with the flow. I'm not one for resting. So I try to fight against it because I can't just sit there. I have to be doing things. <laughs> I'm like Linda. She, I think she said at one point she don't like sitting down. Um, like she has to be doing things. I'm very much similar to that. I can't watch the TV without eating something because it has to occupy me while I'm watching it. Hello! We have another comment. And it's from 
have you drank today? Yes, I've got the drink here, look. So um, it's the watermelon one. I've been, I think what it is, is because sometimes, hello, what was that? Shutting down. Oh, man, I've my battery's dead. <laughs> um, I think what it is, is sometimes when I wake up, I've got this habit of my pillars here, and then in the mornings, I wake up lying on the mattress with my head on the mattress, and I don't know how that works, but I think that's what it is. Because um, remember that when you lie down, blood rushes to the top of your head, so that's why you have to keep it elevated. But yeah, um, my brother has, uh, he's been in the hospital today. No, it was yesterday, and apparently he's dislocated his knuckle here. So that's what the cause was. So I think they've stitched it now, but apparently he was awake during the operation. So that was quite interesting. I suppose, you know, them sort of operations, they have to keep you awake because they need to, if they pull the tendon, they need to see if you're responsive. They do that quite a lot with brain surgeries. Like if they touch a bit of the brain, they need to see that you respond to it. So, yeah. But it was ever so scary. I was watching one... Um, I think it was like accident and emergency and someone was having a brain surgery but they had a seizure while they were operating it was oh man it was so scary to watch because you know he's anaesthetized and he's having a, a fit during the operation that is scary to watch so they managed to calm him down and all you do is you just talk to them and they sort of come around themselves. So, yeah. Um, have I been doing that wrong? No. That's fine. Lovely jubbly. So, yeah. Tomorrow I get a lovely lie-in because I don't have to go to work because it's Friday. So, yay. Super lie-in. 10 o'clock I think I'll get up tomorrow. Nice big lie-in. Coffee. Then wake up to a full English. <laughs> oh, dear me. I do make myself laugh, I have to say. Right, so, hello. We've got another comment there. Have you, um, have you ate and drank today? See, you're very caring. You're like my mum, Tessie. You're always looking after me. <laughs> um yes i have yeah i had the big mac earlier but yeah oh. she where's the c this one here okay that's cool so yeah um i think this is packaged my mum said one came today so it could be that so but it's in a brown box and brown boxes mean part work so it can't be that. But uh, I've got a few team moves as well. So, very excited to get this package. <laughs> I just love... It's so nice when you get a gift. You know, it's it's just lovely, isn't it? So, but I know what's in it. But knowing Liz, she's probably hid something else in the package. Um, because she likes to surprise you. And I... Um, I'm looking forward to it, it but the this actual thing that she sent me it's actually already made it's not it is a painting but it's it's not one that I have to drill you know um what is going on with this there we go so yeah is it can I just check Tessa is this buffering at all because obviously I can't see what you see if you get me until after it's ended then I can see if it's buffering or that um I've plugged the euro in just in case so, yeah. But yeah, I cannot believe all that time I was looking for C and 3 and they've been here the whole time. Like, oh my God, for what time is it? We're doing good, 15 minutes to go. As I said, I'm going to try and get this to an hour because I don't want to keep going into the next stream. Because if I go over, it goes into my... It's sort of eating into the next stream, and that's where we went wrong before. So, 
any comments that I don't respond to, I apologise. You'll just have to re-comment the next show. Or maybe, you know, perhaps you're watching it live and I've not responded, then just drop it in a comment on a video and I'll try and get back to that as soon as I can for you. So, yeah. But I've got sweeties! So I've got sweets and chocolate and, yeah, I'm going to sit down with them. Custard creams. I've got to have a movie night. So I need... Don't forget, the 15th is Titanic, so I will be watching that. So everyone that's a fan of Titanic, I highly recommend you watch it on the 15th. So, yes. And I found that song that I was telling you about. It's called Eternal Feather by Catherine Jenkins. So, yeah. Um, yep. Yeah. Where's the C? And don't forget, guys, it's the last, I can't believe it, Hannah. It's the last one of Ant and Dex Saturday Night Takeaway. It's not going to be the same. Two hours special, apparently. And what's interesting is they're actually doing it from the studio. They're not actually going away. Because when I read up on it, apparently there's been complaints that apparently only the, the half the plane is being used. So whether people pulled out, I don't know. But... I think that's probably the first year they've not done it in Florida because the last one is always, you know, abroad. So, yeah, it's not going to be the same, I don't think. Um, but, you know, as one show ends, we have to look forward to Britain's Got Talent and the boys will be back on there. So, yeah. I think we've had good TV this year. We've had, like, so much on then october we get big brother so yeah oh no oh man yeah that okay that's cool so, um, i'd say this is like a coffee color do you reckon maybe ah okay so yeah you know why that's not buffering because i've got this booster thing this is the booster thing in here. So I've got this booster thing they sent me. So that's probably why it's not buffering. Because this is supposed to be like a booster. So, yeah. I don't think I really need it. But it's something that they included in the deal. So, in the uh, upgrade thing. So, I'm always swapping and changing. Like, I like to have good service. So, if it's poor customer service, then... I'll just pay the termination fee and then just move on to the next one <laughs> to get the better deal. Because BT was good. I used to be with BT, but no, never again. Mm -mm. Their prices are insane. So I do like to have a shuffle around every now and then. But I think you can just have the e rose on its own without the, you know, the, the thingamajig. So, I think they run on their own. Um, oh, I'm losing my mind here. What's going on here? Five. There we go. So, what's that BGT is? Let's have a look here. No buffering. Good, good. Yeah. Um, BGT is back 28 for this month. Kirchhoff, get in there. That's a long way off, though. They normally start mid-month. How bizarre. <laughs> interesting normally it's like around about the 18th but oh man next week is yeah um it's a busy week because i've got oh i've got well the weekends obviously we've got ted j um and i go over the weekends anyway then the week after that you've got my sister's birthday and then She's off for five days. Um, I don't know what the lineup is, whether they're going out for a meal or what have you, but another bloody birthday. I've got a fork out for Roxanne. Me and Roxanne don't like paying for birthdays. <laughs> she's like me. She, she's got an extension. Um, so, like, an extended family now. It's just, like, over the last year or so, it's just grown too big. Um, and twice as many people to buy for i generally don't like buying people gifts um even family members it's not in me 
but you know I, can, I have to buy them unfortunately because so, I just feel like buying a gift is taking money away from like diamond painting like I generally I don't know why but I just don't like buying people gifts <laughs> But yeah, do you know what? I'll probably work on this again probably later because we've literally got this block here, and then we might have to do down here somewhere. We might have to do a skinny one because there's no way we can do a massive big block. It could be like a block to there, and then we do a small rectangle. But I can't believe how much we've got through this. Look at that. That is, I can't get over that. But that's the thing, just, you know, do bits every day. You just have to keep on and on at it. But with the way Timu's going at the moment, I don't think I'm going to get my um, my next painting in time. So we can start it, but no, nah, yeah, that's not going to finish. Because apparently it only arrived at the airport today. So it's my fault for ordering it too late. Oh, nearly, Tessa, nearly. <laughs> That's the worst. So I think this is probably like the lights, isn't it? Because um, I'm a big fan of Titanic. You see, I've got this gorgeous pocket watch. You see? Absolutely beautiful. So that came from a collection, but uh, I no longer do that one. But I'd love it for it to come back out again. I've uh, really enjoying this painting. But yeah. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, where's the cue gone? It's over there. Okay. So yeah, unfortunately the live won't be next week. It'll have to be next. Uh, yeah, next week, the week after of next. So not next week, the week after, because I'm a busy, busy man. So, I just want to get this birthday out of the way now, and hopefully that's no more birthdays until, when's the next one, June? Yeah, might be June. No, the next, I'll tell you who's next, it's Molly. So, Molly's next, and then June, who's in June? I don't think there's anyone in June. July's my dad's, August, there's nothing, September... Well, there is one, but that family member don't talk to me for some apparent reason. Um, so I won't bother about hers. Um, but yeah. So how far have you done on the uh, the barn, Tessa? And isn't the nose boring bloody hell all they bang on about is oh the war in gaza um the post office scandal you know it, it like you do you can tell us about other news you know but they've been saying on the news today that apparently there's fake stamps going around um you know like the barcode ones because ages ago it used to be just like the queen's head and now it's like the king's head with a barcode on it so, yeah, apparently people are using fake stamps and they're coming from China, I believe. So they've been warning people on how to spot the real ones and obviously the fake ones. So the fake ones are sometimes, I think they said it's shinier or duller in colour. So always buy your stamps from, you know, the post office or the actual War Mail website because then, you know, you're using genuine ones. But we do have good news. The King's brand new cash notes are coming out in, I think they said June. So we're going to have um, the brand new King Charles uh, banknotes coming out soon, which is nice. But remember that it's, you know, as one goes into circulation, they'll take Queen's one out. 
so they're not going to be around forever and then people will probably put them on ebay for ridiculous prices um to sell them but why would you pay for like a note i, don't, I just don't get that well right, let's get to a comment we have a comment here and it's, I've done a lot of flour on this one, but I can see a horse face now. Oh, it's a horse face. <laughs> that is like this one then. Yeah. That's good. So, because um, I know you had a break from that, didn't you? And now you've sort of like gone back to it. Are you in your bedroom or up or downstairs? Because I know you said you used to have to do that on the kitchen table because it's so big. So, um, I don't think that will fit on your little table, you know. I need to order my sister's birthday card. Oh, man, so much to go. <sighs> Not enough time in the day. Steve's gone, so have a lovely day, Steve. Thank you for watching. Um, who else was in here? Diamond Paints with TM. And anyone else that is watching, thank you very much. Because um, we are now winding this stream down. So I'm going to finish off this line and then call it a session, I think. Because I've uh, we're up to the hour. Hello, we have... Who is that? It's Diamond Paints with TM. And it is... I'm hanging off the little... <laughs> See, I know you too well. See, that's the problem I have is with big ones. I find that if you put it on the flower, uh, the table, I find that you get hunched back because you have to lean right into the middle of it to get to the middle. I don't like going very big. My favourite size is a 30 times 40s. I will mm, sometimes go to a 30 times, uh, sorry, 40 times 50. What the hell is going on here? Hang on a minute. Q. What's that one? Yeah, that's not supposed to be there. Sorry about that. <laughs> so that's free. Yeah, so 30 times 40 is. I do a lot of 20 times 20 is. Um, sorry, that thing's in the way. Let me change that ticker because that's been running for a few days now. So doo -doo -doo, we've had the list Harrison. We've had the... Let's have this one. So recommendations. So do check out these channels. They're fabulous YouTubers. They do a lot of um, things. And I have thought and i've spoke about this in a previous show i have thought about doing i'm just going to double check that again i have thought about doing a sister diamond painting channel but just purely aimed at you know unboxings just let me know if that's something you'd like to see um but it would literally just be purely unboxings so yeah but I'm tinkering, uh, tinkering with that at the moment. I'm not sure because I do do unboxings on here. So, right, that's that. Wow. All that's left to do is just give it a bit of a rollage. I do love this roller. This came from Timu. You do get other ones that have got rubber on the end of it. It's like a, well, a black handled one that's got the bot. This bit's plastic. But the other ones have, the other ones is like a, um, oh, I think like it's, a, the actual roller is rubber, so I don't like them ones, I like these ones better, so there we go, lovely, fantastic. Okay, so let's put that like so, and can we just take a look at, I, I just can't believe that, that don't feel real that we've done all that, I can't. I mean, when did we start this? What, the 1st of April, was it? Um, it was the Monday, weren't it? So I, I can't believe how much we've done. And I think what's really done it is all this colour block up here. Um, the only thing I don't like, I'm just going to go back and get the comparison because you'll see this in another video because I've covered this already. But this is this looks like a much duller one. This is one that I did and... It, I took it off camera, and you'll find out the reasons when I do my bit when you see that video. But this is that one, and then you've got this one. So can you see it looks different? Because for example, here you have you've got a line coming down here, 
and a line coming down there, right? Well, on this one, that don't seem to have that line. It just looks like it's all blue. So do you see what I mean? This is definitely different. And as I spoke about previously, never think you can get the same, like say like you've missed drills here. Don't think that you can order it and get the same drills because as you can see up here, it says 154. And on the schematic down here, it's actually 158. So don't automatically assume that you can get the same drills. I mean, for example, here, it looks a little bit duller, whereas this one looks a bit more bling. So you see what I mean? It could be that, you know, it's a cheaper, you know, painting, or it could be, because this one I think was like $7.99 on Amazon. But I just feel like this one's a little bit on the dull side, because for that to stand out, and this one don't have that, do you see what I mean? I mean, they've got that VOD. The VOD's there, this line here. That's just about there. That sliver there, I reckon. But let's turn the light off. You can't really see it, can you? They've got the VOD, but where's that triangle thing? You see, it's like a little fishing net thing. It doesn't seem to have it on this one, but it is still colourful. But, yeah, so I do have two of them. And you'll find out why when the next Griffin chat goes. Well, it's probably somewhere up here, but it is looking wonderful, isn't it? I really, really want to get this done for the 15th of April, hopefully. Um, but yes, let me know, Justin, what you think of the, you know, the comparation there. Um, because I would like to, you know, obviously know. So that's that. So thank you for watching. Uh, we are going over slightly. Um, uh, we've done this one yet. So thanks for watching um liking sharing subscribing all that youtube -y stuff the next live show will be on let's have a look here so the next live show will be on the 26th of april and then i'm thinking perhaps do the night you know the night streams from may maybe but uh i've had a good fun i've really enjoyed doing that and uh as you can see look at that isn't that gorgeous what we could actually do actually is if we just get this one as well let me know what your favourite is. They're both the same painting. But yeah. But uh, until then, thank you for watching. Please remember to like, share, subscribe if you haven't done so already. If you haven't subscribed and this is your first time, come along. We'd love to have you here. Um, tap the bell if you want to be notified of all the videos I do. And we will see you next time for another video. So until then, take care and we'll catch you later.